uh, mute this. All right, let's hope that YouTube sends out notifications. We know that they do not like to do that sometimes. Uh, so we will see. Let me, come on, come on, come on. YouTube sends out notifications. We know that. All right, so we know that that works. All right, come on. Oh, don't mess with me here. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Go to the comments. All right, so people are flying in here. Hey, Russell Jackson, thank you for birthday comments. I'm gonna try to post as many of you guys as I can. Uh, but I just wanted to get up here and do a short, quick video. I'll probably be up here maybe like an hour. Uh, it's 321, right? So maybe I'll stay up until 30, we'll see. But I just wanted to unbox some things. I was given rules that there were, there was a gift here that I had to wait to unbox. Uh, but thank you again so much. Let me just go down. Russell Jackson, thank you. Marcus Broom, I appreciate it. LJ Green, Mr. West, thank you so, so much. I still have your daughter's shoes, too. I need to ship those to you. Uh, Boss Cakes, thank you for telling me happy birthday twice. Technology, I really appreciate it. Chauncey, thank you. Thank you, Wesley. Uh, and if anybody's curious, just like the thumbnail, yes, I am 31 today. I am 31. I would have been up here sooner, but mom had me on the phone for three hours, but that's probably what happens when you're an only child and you're not in the same state as your parent on your birthday. Like they wanna make sure that you're fully aware of how much they love you. Thank you, thank you. Let's see, RBA, thank you, sir. Thank you. So let me get through all of them here as much as I can. I'm gonna give you a little bit of time to get in. And then, so a package that, remember we did the whole live thing. I think this might be the, the Fear of God Nike shirt, like already. Uh, I plan to do a full video. I'll probably maybe have it done tomorrow for you guys to be able to see like what that shirt fits like versus regular Nike shirts. And then other essential shirts, because maybe it'll help somebody if you are gonna have to go to the resale market to be able to, uh, buy this year. I just want to make sure you guys have an idea, but we'll look at that. We won't go over it like in deep detail. I'll do that tomorrow, but we'll go over this. This is the actual gift. So uh, it was from Best Laces Out. That means it was also from, um, from Wolf as well. So let me make sure that he actually knows since I had to unbox this live uh, because of him. But um, yeah, so that was a stipulation. I had to wait until uh, I had to either unbox this live or I had to wait until my birthday. And actually, one of my coworkers and friends, she was like, you should do a live unboxing. So that's why we're here. We're going to do a live unboxing before I have to go actually get on with uh, the rest the rest of my day. I've never heard. Oh, uh, well, you are. Wes, Wesley? Yes, definitely. Both. You're both. Jay, thank you. I appreciate it. Chicago Southside, thank you. I'm definitely eating cake today. I'm definitely, I really hope my friend's uh, daughter hooked up an amazing cake for me. I really hope she did. Um, yeah, you guys can ask me questions. I don't, I don't care about that. Um, how many curries do I own in my collection? Uh, one, the one you guys saw me unbox, the Thank You Oakland pair. It's the only pair I have. I'll probably get uh, a pair of sevens and maybe four lows just because I think those are the more lifestyle wear shoes. If I hooped more often, I would probably get a lot more basketball shoes that are actually like made for the court, not like retros where we're all just trying to live fly. But I don't ball enough. Like I don't, I never do now. It's really bad, right? I used to think I was at least halfway decent. I'm straight trash and wash now. Yes, I need chocolate cake today, okay? I need chocolate cake. You guys should already know I'm enjoying some wings as well. Uh, that will absolutely happen. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I plan on really enjoying all of my birthday in a very toned down, chill way. Um, because it's when I say like intimate gathering, it's like three people and that's it. I'm trying to be smart, okay? Rona is still out here and I would like to, you know, continue to be healthy. So. <laughs> Well, yes, Wesley, but Wes is Wesley too. 
Um, well, I don't need to work out in anything in my apartment right now because I have a complex gym I can use. I wouldn't use curries for leg day or squats. They're meant to actually be jumped in and ran in, not actual heavy lifting. Uh, what has been the best B-Day gift you have been given or purchased yourself? Ooh, the best gift I've given. Ooh, I don't even know, like, the best gift I've been given? Um, I don't know. I'm actually one of those people I hate getting gifts just at this stage in life. Um, you receive – me receiving gifts, that's not, like, my language – um, it's because I buy stuff for myself all the time. My best, I'm trying to think back to birthday gifts over the years. Uh, what's the best one I've ever gotten though? I don't know that I can actually pinpoint like some gift that's ever just stood out insanely to me. I'm just going to be honest because I buy so much stuff for myself. And most times when it comes to gifts now, it, it's really at the point where like if my mom or my dad or something are like, oh, we're going to buy you a gift. They just ask me what I want and then they either provide the money or they just go buy that exact item. So I don't even know if I can answer like best best gift I've been given, best gift. I don't know. I'm pretty sure Wolf will probably think that like this here, he'll probably think this is uh, is the best gift that I've been given probably. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. What color? What color and what? Hold up. What do you mean? What color what? Yeah, no joke. I'm glad we pointed out the obvious that apartments pay rent and a house pays a mortgage. I don't know where you're going with that, but okay. Birth is the best gift. Um, I mean, yeah, but sometimes we're adulting and we're just looking at our parents like, you brought me into this? Because <laughs> I swear I look at my mom some way like that, like, man, I, I I know you proud of me, mom. I don't care. So I'll say this. Probably the best gift that I've been given um, on a birthday, it's not like a material thing, right? So I get a card from my mom every year. We've always had this thing where she would always write me notes long heartfelt okay my mom is all about the feels she's a so she was a social worker for like 30 some years all about the feels and um she let me know in the car that like you are my greatest gift so i guess that that there is like the the the, the best birthday gift ever like just knowing that you are truly your parents greatest gift uh you cop some fog earlier yes so if you guys are not aware, did you cop the Navy? Did you cop some of the Navy? So Fog did their seven days of drops. And listen, from what I understand, so I didn't go for the drops this morning. They had rain drum yesterday. They had Navy today, which are never before seen colors by Jerry. I didn't go for anything. I've spent enough this month. I am paying off a student loan as well next week. So we're right, right after the holiday. So I, I had to just... I had to be chill, y'all. I had to sit my little self on down <laughs> and not go for anything today just so I don't mess up the flow of everything else I kind of have planned for this month. But I didn't go for anything. But I heard the drop was just not – it just didn't feel fair, right? Stuff sold out instantly to the point where people didn't even really feel like they had a chance to get, like, the sweatpants or the hoodies. Um, so if you were able to cop anything today, bravo, claps up to you. I don't know what all the resale is going to be for some of this stuff, right? Like, I actually have a sweater. I have a fog sweater on the way. I had to pay $130 on grailed plus shipping. So it was like $145. The sweaters are hot items. I really, I, I want more of the sweaters. I might have to do that. What am I doing for my B day? So I'm uh, I'm still being responsible, right? I'm reading the country. And I live in the state of Indiana where no one knows how to just stay at home. So I've been really uh, reserved. I mean, I'm a, I'm a homebody anyway. And me being at home and working from home, it means I can create a lot of content just in my space. So that's what I do most times. But the only people I've really been around, if we're not counting like random strangers at work or my coworkers at Kids Foot Locker, uh, is my stylist, who is one of my closest friends, and then her husband and um, like her other her uh, co-owner for the salon, her business owner uh, with her. And, you know, they're all really safe. They have to get temperature tested all the time, constantly tested for COVID and things like that. So uh, that's about the safest place I would uh, choose to want to just spend my time. So it's going to be like a really small, like three to five person intimate gathering. That's it. 
uh, just, just to be mindful of everything, right? In terms of the holidays, I'll be just kicking it here at home, probably busy doing a lot of projects. So um, go have my favorite foods. Just, you know, play some games, drink drink a little bit, <laughs> which I never do. And I have to be mindful of that. That recovery is not the same when you're trying to have fun. 31 and 21, you'll recover the same. I have also one of my childhood friends, uh, their youngest sibling just turned 23. And her picture on her story on Instagram, it was like her in a hoodie in her bed all bundled up. And it was like McDonald's <laughs> on the top of the cover. And somebody was like, she was like, I want all my birthdays to, to end like this. And I'm like, you did birthday right. You got the greasy food. You enjoyed yourself. Somebody tucked you in. Bet. So, I mean, that it, it might be me probably eating some uh, uh, Ben and Jerry's, to be honest with you. Um, it is. You probably do think this is the best, best gift I've ever gotten. Uh, I appreciate that. But with everything going on, I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. But I appreciate the sentiment. I you buy stuff for yourself for updated purposes. Uh, not really sure about what that means either. But uh, yeah, I buy a lot of stuff. Thank you, Zaya. I appreciate it. Okay. I really, really do, sir. I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to definitely enjoy it. Um, hopefully not go buying and browsing because we already know that's like the worst thing I do. But thank you so much. <laughs> you was talking. I don't know what you are doing, bro. I have no idea what you're doing. Uh, thank you, Jay. I appreciate it. Please come see us. Thank you. They not a truly appreciate it. Yeah, stop laughing. You just think this is hell funny right now. I copped it all. What did you, what did you, I mean, you copped it all. Yeah, but what did you really get? I'm going to need to see receipts. A uh, huge fan of Richan. Thank you for getting me in the Nike. You are welcome. I will always stand behind. Just do it. They, I've just done it in terms of spending all my money. I mean, hence we got a uh, Nike package right here, right? Uh, I got a T in all three colors. Oh, so you did stellar then. You, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it, favorite blogger. I appreciate that. Thank you. It's a ton of people y'all can definitely watch. Uh, to Sean, thank you. Yes, all the cake. Y'all should already know. All of the cake. Oh, in the world. Oh, wow. I'm reaching big heights right now. Listen. I'm shocked some of y'all be tuning in, to <laughs> be real with you. Uh, the Navy's about to bust heads. Yeah, Navy, I don't even want to look at resale prices for Navy. I really wanted the sweater, and uh, I don't even want to look at it. I don't. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I uh, missed the Navy sweats, but later in the day, I came across some track pants for resale. Yeah, if you can get, listen, resale might be somewhat lower on some items. Like, for the items that are already crazy, like track pants are usually 125 120, I think maybe it's 120. The track jackets are like 125 because I have one back there and had to pay 125 for it. Uh, so yeah, if resale is not too crazy and you're comfortable, pull the trigger, get it, or you can play the long waiting game. Maybe some people will drop the price after Christmas. Uh, Trav, thank you, thank you, appreciate it. Donnell Powell, thank you. Yeah, just don't. <laughs> so he's saying, uh, he's saying 30 because so the joke. I guarantee you, when I walk into my friend's place she will have balloons that say 30 and not 31. And the running joke is that my 30th was celebrated in such an abysmal way. I feel like I want gas and I want money back and I want time back <laughs> that I'm not going to get back. So I deserve to redo my 30th and truly enjoy my 31st. So absolutely. Uh, the birthday kick. So I got the New Balance, the 327s. I got those. If you guys also remember earlier in the year, I picked up the, what did I pick up? Oh, the Air Jordan 3 Retros uh, from 2011. Even has a hang tag and the OG box. So I picked up those. I think you guys actually forgot about that. And I promise. So I have this planned out December. Woo, child, this is going to show how much I failed this year. I will do three separate videos. I'm going to do a video of all the Jordans I bought this year, all the Nikes I bought this year, and all the non-Nikes I bought this year. And you guys are okay, and you can flame me in all three videos that I certainly didn't stick to the list. But I'm going to do those videos for you guys. I'm going to do three separate videos of Jordans, Nikes, and non-Nikes, and... um. I mean, I could, well, you can blast my spending too. So that's fine. If people pay attention to everything I've spent this, this, this month, all they got to do is go look up what the prices are. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, you know, who's talking about the last drop? I got gray sweats and shorts. Hey, uh, G fish. Those are, 
Those are the ones. You can you can you can do so much with those. Those are the ones. Happy birthday. I almost been said, you know what? But listen, my tendencies are all Scorpio. I landed in the exact right time. You can look up everything for a Scorpio. It's true. <laughs> it's pretty true. It's very true. Mike Devon, thank you, legend. Uh, I'm trying to live to be one. Uh, was it the white cement threes, true blue threes, stealth threes, or black cement threes? It would be the white cement threes. Those are the ones that came out in 2011. Whoa, you're the best. Thank you, D. Get off my like I want to unbox a gift, and then I am going to go celebrate. And I actually need to call my godparents back and my grandma back. I'm just trying to do this for you guys. All right, so it's been 15 minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. You are amazing. Thank you for the donation, for real, for real. You're, you're awesome. All right. E, see, I even waited until I you were done with work. She said work was weak. <laughs> work was weak. I'm sorry. I'm going to be back at work next week. I'm going to be in the store next week. And we're going we gonna to laugh like always. Deal with them customers that I don't know what they be thinking. To be real with you. All right. I have not peeked in this. The only thing I, was, I did is I, uh, I took the shipping label off so you guys couldn't see anything. She took the ship away, blow off. Oh, well, happy early birthday. Your birthday's almost here. Happy early birthday. Happy early birthday. Uh, I'm with you on the failing of shoes many words. Yeah, listen, it's, it's okay. I've accepted my failures for this year. I've accepted my failures. Okay, again, I've not looked in this box. This is the first time. We're all doing this together, okay? All doing this together. Okay, I have a few items. Okay, well, I kind of had an idea of one. But okay, this is another item. So if you guys are not aware, this is from Best Laces Out, okay? So sneaker shop, consignment shop down in Fayetteville, North Carolina. If you're down in the South, in that area, shop. They have kicks. You can buy your kicks. You can sell your kicks. You can buy tons of streetwear. So 99% of the Supreme or Antisocial Social Club you guys see me wear, uh, it's all from there. And I think they also had the J. Cole uh, collaboration in there. So please make sure you freak with them. You let them know I sent you. Oh, yay. And I don't know what I'm wearing tonight for my birthday. Like, I feel like there's a lot of pressure on what I'm going to wear. Y'all are scaring me. But, ah, more Supreme. Okay. I don't care that they just had uh, pretty much a buyout of $2 billion. I'm still going to continue to rock them. I don't care if it gets mass produced. So, thank you, Wolf. So, this is a Justice for All shirt. As soon as this came in, I was like, that shirt is amazing. Uh, but they were gracious enough to have just sent me a shirt. So, I, I was like, you know what, let me be chill. But Wolf was awesome enough to put this aside for me. So we got Supreme on the front. It's clean. It's low key. I really, really love it. So this is adding to my collection. I really do have like a good, good. What other shirts do I have now? Like five or six? Five or six shirts. So all of my shirts are from Best Laces Out. It's only the sweatshirts that I went, uh, I had to go elsewhere to find. But thank you. So now I'm really contemplating if I'm going to wear this tonight. Part of me wants to break out like shoes that I don't ever wear. Part of me wants to. I don't know. I don't know. What I'm, I don't know if I'm going to do it. All right. So we got this. I don't know if I can like put this where y'all can see it. All right. I'm struggling. We're cool. Okay. Ugh. Other stuff in the box. Now, <laughs> here's the thing. So I don't have like 90 shirts. I don't have like nine. Let's not exaggerate. I wish I had like 90 Supreme shirts. No shirt. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So I stay in these two streets. <laughs> yeah, no, this, this, this block is chill. This block is, this block is chill. This block is chill. Uh, Zaya's block is not chill, but that's okay. He embraces it. Ah, this is the best bag to see always. It's the best bag to see. All right. So small. That is me and all Supreme things. Awesome. I don't have 90 shirts. I don't have 90 shirts. Oh, I, I will dead seriously roll up in these. <laughs> okay, so this is from Paxson. This is this is specifically a gift from Wolf. So this is more so from Best Laces Out. The shirt is more so from uh, Best Laces Out. But truly, the this gift is from Wolf. Personal gift from him. Okay, so I have the essentials sweatshorts. So I have other ones, but they were from older collections. So like I have the one tan pair and then I have the fear of God, one of the iridescent pairs, but 
This is from the brand new, uh, the black drop that they put out uh, end of last month, I believe. So from PacSun, as you guys can see, very, very happy. So I live in sweatshorts now. I'm rocking actually minimal sweatshorts right now as I'm doing this video. So I have a small thank you, thank you. Uh, I really might roll up in, in shorts. Don't play with me, y'all. Don't play with me just so I can be comfortable. Y'all know when you have a little you have a little drink, you get a little hot. I'm not one of those people that likes to get hot, though. <laughs> break out the new new. I know. I'm thinking about it. Like, do I, I, should, I should break out the new new. I should rock the Supreme. I already know my friend's husband. He's going to flame me because he always does. Like, I just went over there. It was his, his dad. Was it his dad's? I think it was his dad's birthday. And so I was over there. It was a small family gathering again. I went over there and I'm just, what did I rock? The, oh, the UNC, the Obsidian ones. He's like, really? You just had to come over here in those, huh? <laughs> so I'm sure I'm going to get something. I'm thinking about like, should I undead stock, you know, the, the Concord 11s? Like I, I have my, I have my 2011 pair, but should I undead stock the Concord 11s? That's a good question. Or should I rock the breads? Cause goodness knows they didn't get love outside of styling them. So I'm going to have to break some now, even though I bought New Balance as a birthday shoe. I'm not sticking to birthday rules right now. But okay, so we have this, which is technically a full fit that works because if you guys remember, either birthday shoe would go with these, either the threes or the New Balance shoes. Either one would, would go with those. Like I have decisions to make. Of course, I'm going to post about it on Instagram, which you guys can absolutely... Uh, go follow me there if you don't already. If you don't, I'm not saying I'm hurt. I'm just saying, what are you doing with your life? Uh, that, that's all I'm asking. Simple question. Um, I have to get back to all the messages on Instagram too. And when I tell you, I'm going to be busy trying to do that. I'm going to be a little busy trying to do that. But yeah, I will for sure post probably, probably the outfit on Instagram so you guys can you know, be able to check me out. All right. There I am right there. I just hit 12K on Instagram too. That was unexpected. So really appreciative of that. But yeah, these are, so these are the shoes, of course, that I got for my birthday for myself. Okay. You already know I'm all about the pics. So got, got, got that up. This was my like birthday, official birthday post <laughs> um, about life. And yeah, so got the LeBron's, the icons on heavy, the minimal camo pants, which those draw cord, those cargo draw cord two pants. I need more pairs. Trust me, I'm about to hit minimal up. Be like, listen, hope, hope me out. As my dad would say, hope me out. Let me get those. Um, these are just throwbacks. No, that's not a throwback. What is this? This, let me click on that. So this is actually a throwback. So if you guys didn't know, I was blessed, very fortunate, right? I was part of Air Max Day with Nike. Um, amazing experience like truly to have a whole team there for the day and they only care about you and they are checking on you and making sure you don't need a thing. It was the most, it was the most crazy thing ever to ever experience. Uh, but this, these are just behind the scenes shots from that day. I just, I don't think I ever posted these specific shots. So this was into the, into one of the cameras that we were doing a shot for. And then this was a, a turnaround picture that we were able to get. So it was an amazing day, hands down, to be able to do that. Um, man, I, uh, I will always for, for sure remember that. Like that, this is when I tell you when 2020 was still a year to remember for me. It was a crazy year, absolutely. Hey BFF, thank you, AKA that's AJ. Thank you guys, thank you. Tell wife I said hi as well. Yeah, that day was that day was crazy. That day was insane. I was super, super. I was, and the funny thing is, there was a snowstorm going out outside, so I had to go to the to the shoot. It was held at the mall at that Foot Locker in a snowstorm. I did. I ate a donut that day. I did. I posted a donut that day. Uh, thank you, Raymond. I appreciate it. Many more. Yeah, man. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, thank you, fellow sneakerhead. I appreciate it. Thank you, Slick50. I really appreciate it. Let me see. Did I miss anybody? Yeah, the pants are amazing. So if you guys get a chance, they're, they're, if your size is available still on Minimal, you can click the link. 
that's in the description box and you'll be able to, to get to get those. But these pants hit check all the boxes, like all the boxes. Absolutely all of them. Someone show you should rock a DS pair of kicks to attach them to a good memory. I show that would mean well. So in terms of DS, the true DS kicks that I have are actually the Concords. The new, the newer Concords. Those that's the most DS pair that I have outside of the double up of the Flint 13. And I'm never breaking those out until I trash this pair that I have. So you guys are right. I probably should break out. The, I should break out the 2018 Concords. Uh, it would be a very definitely a memorable, be something memorable for me uh, for 31st birthday. And if you all don't know the story, people ask they ask often, right? In every interview, uh, what what shoe like really got you hooked in this game? And it, it was the Concord. Uh, it was being able to see that for the first time. I was already always into shoes, but. It went to a different level when I saw that shoe in hand in person when I was younger. It was like, you know, in 2001. So that was a shoe. That was a shoe for me. That 11, that patent leather. Uh, those are always restocking our bunch of the resale market fish. Yeah, a lot of stuff. So you know what the funny thing is? The, uh, what is it? The shooting. It's not the shooting shirt. It's the warm up. So the warm up, the black one was on Nike yesterday for a fear of God in Nike. You all could have bought that. And since uh, I'm on that topic, since I got these two, so I'll put this here. I'll put this here. None of y'all talk about me if I go out in shorts today, okay? I don't even want to hear it. Um, all right, so I'll turn this this way. So, again, I'm not going to dive into this. I will do a video for it tomorrow because I want to show you guys sizing and all of that. But it's already here. So I'm put this on the ground so here we go okay 45 dollars live unboxing okay there we go i went with the medium now i got a medium in this i typically don't everything that is fog because of the way it fits it's meant to be oversized i don't get a medium in the tops i get a small in that track jacket i could have gotten an extra small and been good and supreme shirts just because of the way they are i'll go with a um help me out I'll go with a medium or even a large. So like this will be a medium and it'll fit me like most of the me mediums will. So, all right, here's this. All right. So again, we got, you know, Nike tag on there. Okay. Uh, and this is the flip side of the tag. So Jerry Lorenzo, you're a guy. Now, people, please wear, please read the care tags because I, I swear, people, we already saw that debacle when somebody tried to launder those pants and they were terrible. Um, this garment was created using printing techniques and fabrics that require special care. Of course they do. It just means it's going to cost me more money to have to launder the shirt, but that's fine. Because, yeah, I definitely want to go into the full details with you guys about it. You know, what's stitched, what's not. I just, I'll, I'll go over all that, but... They got paper. So it's so it's more wide than anything else. It's more wide. I think it's going to fit probably like the Supreme large shirts that I have. I'm going to be honest with you. So it's not that I didn't go for a small. I tried on both phones for a small and a medium. The medium order went through. And I'm going to take what I can get on a sneakers app uh, drop. It was really on Nike that I ended up getting it though. All right, so here we go. Now, this is oatmeal. Unfortunately, the shock drop on Fear of God is what had the uh, the gray and then the ivory. So, and then you do have this swoosh. Now, what's different about this swoosh, um, it is stitched on, and last year's was just printed on the very front, like right here. And then you have the NBA logo. Now, I also have those pants, right? The alternative sportswear pants are on the way as well. So when those come in, I'm going to do probably like a full lookbook of like how I would style this and other essentials pieces I have in. And then I'll probably do a full breakdown of the pants. So if you don't know the pants I'm talking about, if you are subscribed to Locust and Wild Honey, he picked up these pants. And it's funny because he actually found out about them. Um 
from um, JM and JM actually gave me a full look at the pants. Um, he, he let me see what they look like on Instagram and I'm so glad I got them. So they're that light bone colorway, very similar to the um, the fall the um, fall grades I have. And then this is what all of the tags look like on the Nike Fair Guy clothing. So I'm, I mean this. So I mean this was Thursday, and it's already here. So talk about. I also have a pretty decent beeline in terms of shipping, right? When you look at zones and lanes and shipping, Memphis to where I am is pretty just it's, it's a good straight line. So I get quite a bit of stuff from Nike really fast, even if I don't pay uh, for 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 extra shipping. So scroll down because I'm sure I missed some. Uh, it's my birthday too. Oh, happy birthday, Brandon. SB Dunklow Infrareds came in a day from StockX. Happy birthday, November 21st, first twin. Thank you. Happy birthday. That's an amazing shoe. Uh, that's one of my favorite pickups by far this year. One of my favorite pickups by far. Mark, what's up? Hey, thank you. Uh, no, stop jumping around. If your team fall, your team dry clean by default. You are. You are. You don't have a... You don't have a choice but to be. You just don't. Unless I mean, unless you don't care about the care of your items. Uh, guess you think about copying those new. Uh, I am not. I did a whole video on why I don't want them. I have Space Jam from 2009, 2016. I have Bread 11s. I don't see a need to get the anniversary pair. If they were ever, like, if, if somebody else is buying them, then fine. I don't care for the Jordan name down the actual eyelids. But it's certainly not the worst non-OG Jordan I've seen, no Jordan 11 I've seen. So if it were something where it was gifted, seated, it's a great pair. I would absolutely wear them. But for me to go out and drop the 170 or probably 180 plus tax I'm going to have to drop on them for a grade school pair, that I'm not doing. I'm, I'm just not doing that. Yeah, you have everything. You literally have everything right now. We do. So what are you saying? The same shirt. He was able to get the friends and family shirt before the manufacturer couldn't even get that color shirt in anymore. So he has a shirt that I don't even have. And it's my damn shirt. Thank you. I appreciate it. That's right. 313. Still my phone number. Literally, my phone number is still area code 313. Yeah, we'll never change it. If I ever have to change my phone number, I'm going to be hot. I'm going to go off on somebody. For real, for real. Uh, let me see. Quality in the fog looks on point. It is on point. And with the fact that it's on point, you have to pay a little bit more, right? When you get nice suits and things in, right? Normally men, men's wear, you, you have to, you have to do a little bit more too. Oh, I forgot to show you this. So the tag on the back is not white. It's actually oatmeal. That's pretty cool. Tag on the back is oatmeal. So like I have this, I mean, I would really, oh, I'll put my shorts in the other room. Never mind. I put my shorts in the other room. Um, I'll show you guys a sneak peek since you guys are on here live with me. I'll show you a sneak peek. I got um, a project that you'll find out about next week on Instagram, but I might break this out. So this has been back here for a minute. I don't know if you guys have seen it. <clears throat> yeah, uh, I'm not going to say I feel a little bougie with this, but I definitely do. So... This is, uh, let's call her Precious, okay? This is my Nike faux fur jacket, courtesy of Swoosh, because they are awesome, and it's been an amazing year. So, again, I'll have a, you, follow me on Instagram, okay? And then I'll have a video up about what the actual project is, but I might have to break this out tonight. I'm gonna have to break this out, maybe with the Concords, right? Break this out, just big old faux fur swoosh. Just, just walk in, obnoxious as ever. I might though. I'm not even joking. I think I already told my mom. I'm, I'm pretty much gonna uh, probably break that out today. Uh, another item I got in, I didn't show you guys yet. Ooh. So these are probably back in stock now, I think, on Nike. But this is the training beanie. So the green one you guys have seen me wear, they have a black and white one. Okay. Much more neutral. And it's $26. So I love the fact that there is, like, this really hard, like, stitching that's there. So it's great quality. 
It's ribbed here, and it is dry fit. I haven't even taken the tag off yet, as you can see. So I have, like, I got, I got lots of options. I'm not going to wear the Fear of God shirt tonight. I need to actually do content on that, so that can go there. This might work, though. Well, I'm not. I literally just did my hair on Thursday, so I feel like I'm not wearing a hat tonight. So the hat is going to be out. <laughs> but I think I might have to wear this. I definitely might have to wear this. And my kind of forwards. And I don't know what pants I'm going to wear now. Do I just throw on fog sweats? Maybe. I just throw on fog sweats, maybe. That might be the move. They should have just done the actual sketch. Sketch for what? What am I missing? What am I missing? Actual sketch for what? Flex with the jacket. I Mike, I might have to flex with the jacket. I might have to flex with the jacket. Um, the jacket is amazing. Like, you guys, listen. You don't even understand. Like, this jacket is an obsession. You don't even understand. The jacket is an obsession. Okay? It's big old swoosh on the front. Big old swoosh on the front. Um, now, if you are up today, Nike has a blanket in black with a big old cream swoosh on it. It's 175 That thing sold out already. I thought about trying to cop it. Ooh, but no. Birthday, thank you. I appreciate it. I'm doing my best. I got, I at least have content planned out for you guys through June of 2021. After that, we'll see what happens. That's our gangster. <laughs> this is my this is my Frank Lucas. This is if Frank Lucas and Nike joined forces and did a collaboration. Straight up. If Frank Lucas and Nike had a collaboration, that that there, that code is it. All I need is a furry hat. All I need is a furry hat. Jack is fine. Nothing wrong with being bougie. <laughs> I told him when that jacket came in, did I message my mom or my friend or one of my friends? I was like, when, you're, when I'm in this jacket, I don't know y'all. I can't hear y'all. And I've like fallen behind on my water today. I got to stay up on this. I'm 31. I'm old now. I have a nice set of grills. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. I mean, I went through braces and thank goodness it did its job because they cost enough for real, for real. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna flex. Definitely gonna flex with the jacket. Definitely the jacket. So we all we all are on one accord, right? The jacket and Concord Elevens and Supreme, because it clearly coordinates with the Concords. We gonna figure out the pants situation. I may do camo. I'm not sure. I gotta figure out the pants. I definitely have to figure out the pants situation. I also have some Jordan pants I never wear, but they're gray, so I don't know. How I would feel about it. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna work it out. If you follow me on Instagram, I'm sure I'll be in my stories and in my closet trying to figure out what's going on. Um, and you guys have hopefully seen like my closet at this point, the fact that I did redo it and everything. So we'll give you like a view. I was being lazy. I was laying on the floor of my closet one day, no joke, procrastinating, procrastinating like crazy. And yeah, I was laying on the floor and I was like, I should really get up and do some work. I think I had dishes and laundry to do. But the the Concords are not out. They're like one of the few shoes that are still kept in the box because clearly it's a Concord. But uh, I think I'm going to have to pull the trigger and break them out. That's going to be difficult. Uh, and I, I can't scroll back far enough on my Instagram. I post too many pictures for that. But I had a... I did like a tribute picture for Brittany Elena because she did a Concord one in 2018 when, when she was gifted those and she had like a whole little Christmas shoot for it. And I was pretty much trying to, trying to do like the side by side with her. That was one of the last times I wore them. I put them away. I put them away. So of all the kicks that I have, I should probably break out my Concord 11 for real, for real. But all right. Yeah. You guys, if you're not following me, here's all my stuff. So there's a ton more that's always posted on Instagram than on YouTube. Try not to saturate y'all too much. Uh, but you guys, you guys saw this. This is literally a thumbnail. You guys saw that. Go for the fog sweats for comfort. There's cake involved. You know what? You are absolutely right. 
You are absolutely right. I don't need anything constricting tonight because calories do not count on my birthday. And when I tell you my friend's daughter is a bomb baker, you know what? I can show you better than I can tell you. Let me pull up her daughter's work. I'm pretty sure she's posted stuff that her daughter's cooked, okay? She's also an amazing uh, stylist, so, okay? Listen, I'm about to get the work when it comes to a cake, okay? I expect the work there to be put in, I'm telling you. So, yep, yep, I'm excited, can't wait. Did someone say cake? I said cake. I don't care if it's cake, I don't care if it's cupcakes, I want some chocolate cake today. And it would have been awesome and Ben and Jerry's would have just gifted me a whole bunch of milk and cookies, but that's not, I can't control everything, but I definitely am getting some cake. So you know what? We're going to put those 11s on. Uh, it was a concourse sketch with letters on the side. Yeah, we could have just, had they just, once again, brands, stop doing what you think we want and do what we're asking you to do and all would be well. All your shoes would sell out, we'd all be cool, but it's like, Brands are like men that just don't listen or they say that they're listening, but they're like really not listening. Same with women. Um, I won't just, I won't just target the men. Men and women just don't be listening for real. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you. Super sticker. I don't know why I didn't pop up as a super sticker, but thank you so much. <laughs> Life's too short to not apply to Nike corporate. You know, the business product and vision go for it. Um, so I've always said this, if I were to ever leave um, the already corporate uh, employer I work for, it would have to be Nike to draw me away from it. Um, now, I will say this, though. I have a lot more stability in what I do versus Nike right now. And I'm only saying that because they had the whole um, um, digit, like, uh, they digitalized everything or a lot of things, right? A lot of it is, is e-commerce focused now. So they had to go through layoffs. That, I mean, was really difficult. I couldn't imagine having to go through rounds of layoffs and things like that. My, my, my employer hasn't gone through any of that, but it would be Nike. It would be swoosh. And it would just be because it's not like me going to work every day would be me trying to learn every single day. Like you would probably not even find me in the department I'm supposed to be in because I'm over here trying to learn from everybody else and somebody's got a story to tell it's it's something historical about nike i'm trying to listen i'm trying to be in the meetings i'm trying to be the fly on the wall i don't i don't need to say anything just let me just let me sit just let me understand the process of everything so that would be certainly the one job i would do it and you know what if it happens one day i mean that would be awesome that'd be a dream come true turn those up to be for you <laughs> Um, listen, that jacket is a flex, no matter what, that jacket is a flex, so is, uh, so is the blanket, the Nike blanket was, it was insane, the Nike blanket and the jacket cost the same amount, they cost the same, so if you were to give me a choice, though, I would rather have the jacket, so it's meant to be worn out, otherwise, if I'm paying 175 for a blanket, I'm wearing the blanket out, I'm about to Rick James this, uh, I'm about to Rick James's blanket. Thank you, Taylor. I appreciate it. Yeah, I, I would, Nike would be the one place. Uh, when is the unboxing? I did the unboxing, Rick, so I'll just go over it again for people that were not in, because I, de I definitely got to get off of here. Make my phone calls, uh, prep this dog, stay at home, be chill and copacetic, and then I got to get ready uh, to go where I need to go, because I have to go somewhere, go there at six, so. All right, so we got the Supreme shirt. Thank you, Best List is out. Thank you, Wolf. You guys are amazing, right? It's the one that says justice for all. Of course, it caught my eye with everything going on in the world today. This is especially for Wolf. Thank you for my fall shorts. So excited. Nobody asking me how often I'm going to wear these shorts or how much I'm going to neglect my other shorts. <laughs> I have so many. I have so many sweat shorts. They're in a a, a wooden like basket because I don't have anywhere else to put them. So they're all just stacked and I just grab them as I go throughout my week. But I have these now. So excited. You guys should already know. I, I Part of me cares about fall more than I do about uh, drops a lot of times these days. And then this wasn't like a birthday gift, I guess, to myself. I just wanted, you know, the Nike fall drop. So here's the shirt. 
It is a medium. Okay. I tried for a small too. Medium was the one that got through. Beggars can't be choosers when it comes to buying on sneakers app for anything. Uh, so the resale on this, it's funny. So people were like, oh, the shirt sold out so fast. Yeah, because you pay $45 for a shirt and you can resell it for $120. That's unfortunately why. But I got this. As long as I had a shirt, I was good. I love the fact that it has a, you know, a tighter collar. I hate stretched out collars. It's just, it's not the move. The whole bacon neck thing is not the move, but this is a decent, this is a heavyweight like shirt too, but it is wide. So it's going to fit me boxier. So the small might've been the better fit. But again, I was trying to check out a small and a medium, whichever was going to go through. And they said that this fits true to size. So that's another thing we're going to dive into. I'm going to try, um, how's the shoe floating in the back? Uh, it's, it's a magnet that's at the top of the device and you put a magnet in the shoe. There's also a video on my channel. It shows you uh, how to do everything. So watch that. But yeah, it's, it's magical. 11s, jacket, pants to be determined. Flex on them. Absolutely. And then once I get the flex pick, I will post on the community tab as well, just for proof that I had this all. We, we, we as a team, we as a crew decided what I was rocking in this party. Why do I talk like that? Uh, because this is just the vernacular in which I use to express my thoughts and opinions. Would you prefer that I talk in that diction? <laughs> Still ain't worn my new Concords. Uh, they're in there. They're in the box. They just chilling. They just uh, they're they're just chilling. Last B day question: The Dunks hype dying in twenty twenty one. Um, I don't know. I feel like does anybody else feel like Air Force Ones are making an insane? run right now i can't be the only person that thinks that like with the amount of air force ones i see coming into the store even for kids uh it just seems like there's like air force ones may be the maybe the new wave um i did not cop any fall navy nothing and to my knowledge a whole lot of people that wanted it didn't cop it either this morning listen she's a beast and she's only like 15 or 16 she is a beast in the kitchen Baking? This girl has her own business. It, 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 she goes to her mom, but it, it's like her own business, truly. I feel like you're my friend. <laughs> Thank you, Alexis. Thank you. I appreciate that. I really, really do. I really, really do. Go baggy, but not too baggy. Yeah, I'm, so here's the funny thing. When you get fog sweats, they are they're more tapered at the leg than anything. So, um. I, I, I got a few options in my head because I kind of do want to go just the fog sweats. Like I have the, I don't know. Here's the only thing though. I have gray fog sweats and I have the buttercream ones and that's it. That's why I have charcoal fog sweats on the way. I only had two colors. So uh, buttercream would probably go better with this. I just don't know that I want to... Maybe I could go buttercream. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. I'm going to have to play around. I'm sure I'm going to pull out a few different pants. Camo is still a possible option just because it can offset everything. Um, but, yeah, we're going to go Supreme shirt. We'll go Concords. We'll go this jacket. And we'll figure out the West. The rest, I don't know how many Nike chains I'm throwing on. I will not be judged. I don't care. Well, you can judge. I don't care. I'll roll up with all well, eight or nine of those Nike chains I had. Be cool. I'm just saying. Uh, let me see. All right, let me let me get to a last bit of these. Uh, 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 what'd you miss? Uh, just some boxing, just some just some stuff. But yeah, the dunk craze might carry through half of the year, and then I think it'll jump to something else. I think it'll jump to something else. I'm heading into the shop. Hit me up. We'll do. I will definitely do that. Tell Joe I said hey. Tell him I said thank you. Can we get a hair tutorial? Um, I did one like so long ago. Um, but yeah, I, I do my own hair. So in terms of the care and upkeep, like my trims, my stylist does that, who I'll be with tonight. My stylist does my trims um, to, to keep my hair healthy because it does grow pretty fast. I'm trying to think. Your products, of course, matter. So I use everything that she gives me. 
And I mean, I my hair is really low maintenance, so some of it is just going to depend on your hair texture and style. But yeah, I did my hair Thursday night. So let me tell you how late this versus battle was. I I, I was about I started to blow dry my hair. I was going to do it at eight. I sat there. Uh, no, I was going to straighten my hair. I delayed straightening my hair, thinking this versus battle was going to start directly at eight. I was almost done by the time the battle started at like 845. So it took them forever, but Jeezy won that. I'm not hearing any debates. I don't care what dis diss tracks are played. I don't care. Jeezy won. That's all I'm saying. Okay. Just point that out. One. Uh, but I might, I'm, I mean, we'll see. We'll see if I would do like a hair tutorial. Listen, none of the guys would tune in to that video. It would certainly be something only the women probably tune into. Uh, but maybe one, maybe one day, um, I'll, I'll do it. Uh, from Portugal, keep it up. Happy birthday. Thank you so much, Daniela. Really appreciate it. Thank you. I'm going global, which is actually really cool because you can see like CPM, um, and the money you make and like the countries that it's coming from. And second is actually Australia. So that's wild. I agree. Air Force One is 2022. You're going to make money by the cold blue ones. Is that is that what you think is going to hold like a lot of value? I just feel like those those ones Air Force ones just seem to really be going up. Um, and I say that also because Travis Scott continues to want to collaborate on the Air Force One, so I think it'll be good. Uh, thank you, I appreciate it. Uh, big Big LJ, Big LJ. Fact, Snowman One. Listen, I'm, I'm I just got done with my hair. Just got done. I mean, just got done. Last part of my hair I needed to straighten. <laughs> and uh, Jeezy, put, Jeezy starts put on. I'm sitting here in my bathroom, hype, jumping around. Like, I don't, I, I definitely need to clean up my bathroom. I'm sitting there, hype, jumping around, geek. So he won. I don't really care. The hood knows who really won. Uh, yeah, not Gucci. Definitely not that night. We ain't talking about the hood. We talk about them songs. I uh, wish you more to come. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Listen, I have so I don't even know what rip and dip is. No idea what that is. You've asked me a lot. I don't even know what that is. Don't even know what that is, but it's almost 4 15. Almost been up here an hour. So I need to call my guy parents and not stay on the phone for three hours like I did earlier today with my mom. Um, get some of the stuff cleaned up, pick out the pants for tonight that I'm gonna wear. That's a Detroit, South Carolina thing. You know what? Listen. Soon as the song played, you know, you know, as soon as it played, you already know. So absolutely, uh, always, gotta show love, 313 Detroit. I haven't been home in forever, though, so I got to do that. How often do you go live? Okay, not enough, probably, um, because so much of my content, it's, it's planned because it is B-roll, it's unboxings, it's discussions. So not tons, but I will do my best to try to go live maybe twice a month or something. You know, if there is a topic we want to expand on, I'll try to go live more. Uh, they won't always be an unboxing of like the, the birthday gifts. Absolutely not. I buy enough that it, I probably could do that, but I will absolutely go live more. I promise. Um, I'll even try to get AJ to hop up here so we can get a, a lot of gen uh, conversation just generated about kicks, Fashion, streetwear, whatever, you know, we will do that. Twice a month? Okay, Big L, twi twice a month. You guys will get all of your regular content. And then if it's a day I go live, I just won't do, um, I just won't do like a video that day maybe. When are we going to do some Q&A? Um, I should probably schedule a Q&A soon because I haven't done one since I hit 15K. And I know I have a lot more new subscribers here, so... I will definitely go live more. I promise. I'm listening. I got I got your feedback. We will go live more. Absolutely. I didn't. I didn't cop anything. Um, I passed this morning. I, I have other stuff that's on the way. There is a, a, a brand owner. She owns a gym. She's a, a fitness coach. She's amazing. She, her line. So women, if you're really into like athleisure, more of that unisex clothing, she has a great line for fitness stuff and just uh, casual stuff. She is dropping um, hooded flannels, and I really, really want to support those. So I plan on picking that up. I think she's dropping it on Black Friday. So I will for sure buy something from her, one or two things. Um, another thing is 
don't be shocked if you see me up here with a different eye color at some point. I'm just warning you. So I wanted to play around just to have fun with color contacts. My mom flipped out at the fact that I said I was going to play around with color contacts. But I want to get them. And there is a, uh, of course, you can do the whole virtual try on. And I may or may not have done that. I may or may not have loved it. So this may happen sometime soon. All right. No one freak out. Okay. Just fun to just try things. I had blonde in my hair once. Everybody survived. Everybody was good. So listen, I'm, if, you, if I come up here, okay, I look like I'm fresh out of twilight, just, just you're going to be okay. Okay. They might look a little hazel. They're dark brown. They might look a little hazel, <laughs> but I'm absolutely no joke. Now I feel like God knew what he was doing by not giving me eyes like this because I just feel like he knew that, uh, I would be a problem. I would probably get on a lot of people's nerves, but that's happening. I am absolutely ordering those. Not to mention I did the math. Do you know it's going to cost me less money to buy those than the ones I buy now? Same prescription. So this is more of a financial. This is a frugal business matter. This is a frugal matter. I'm putting more money back into my pockets. And if I order the three-month subscription, I save even more money. So don't be shocked if you see me up here. Not dark brown eyes anymore. They're a little bit lighter. We're going to all survive. Uh, the live is dope. I've seen other lives. People get lit. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'm not. Listen, just based on the fact, I can see the demographic of people that watch me. And there are young adults, kids that watch me. Like I have, I have kids as young as 13 and even a little bit younger. I know for a fact because they've come into my store and they've said, oh my God, you're talking to TJ. And they're like eight years old. So I'm well aware of the individuals and the kids that like my audience and I don't want to put something out there. I wouldn't be happy to present to them, right? Like I do want their parents to feel okay watching me. So I'm not about to come up here drinking, take shots. That's just not me. I don't have an issue with anybody else that does it because you're an adult and you can certainly do that. It just won't be something that I'll do. Okay. With my friends, uh, I will responsibly enjoy adult beverages as an adult is, is allowed to do. And, but that just won't be done, you know, here on the live stream. Now I don't ever want people up here paying for me to take shots. No, I'm good. I'm cool. Um, I appreciate you guys just stopping by really to see me unbox my, my items. Um, when you guys support, reach out, all of that. Stay tuned for the videos. Monday's video is already queued up. I got to edit Tuesdays. I got to get Sunday. I got to get tomorrow's ready. But we're going we're gonna to have tons of content. Absolutely. We'll definitely have tons of content. Thank you, Alexa. I'm here for the context. I'm all for the context. See? 13. I need to act as well like I have some sense. I can't, I can't just be out here acting wild, y'all. I can't. I can't. I can't. Yolanda, thank you. I was wondering when you were going to pop in here. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I like your mental output. My line of thinking is similar to yours, which is why I can relate to you. We're the same age. Salutes. Thank you, Socratic My 89 I appreciate it. Yeah, it's it's fun. It the, the, the kicks, all of that truly keeps us young in a way because there's always something new. It takes us back to our childhood always. But I am an actual 31-year-old adult. I have to think of everything. I have to think of all the optics. Um, I also have to think of brands that have chosen to step out on good faith and work with me. Whether I know it or not, I'm always going to end up being some type of representation for them because we've been linked in some way, right? I'm plastered on Foot Locker's actual Instagram page from uh, from Air Max Day. So I, I'm always I'm always aware of that. So I just gotta be you got you gotta you gotta know and just be chill. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Michelle, Sam. Thank you. So yes, thank you guys for tuning into this always. Um, same thing. <laughs> Listen, I hope your dog has an amazing lit day. Hope you got like, you know, I don't know the, the puppy Chino or something. I don't know. My dog is like attitude. No, when, when she, she didn't care that today was my birthday. Really? Like she didn't care. She didn't care at all. She just wanted to be let out. That was it. She's been sleep the whole day. Uh, but I'm going to get up out of here. Get ready, because I'm supposed to be somewhere at 6. I'm going to try to not be the procrastinating late person like this versus battle. It was all late. 
Uh, I was really fond of Channing Ray. Such a genuine energy. Thank you for the content. You're doing your thing. Thank you, Jade Kim. That's truly. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Chill Town. What's up, man? Appreciate you. I know you. I know you always engage with Zayas content. So thank you. I, I absolutely know who you are. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Definitely appreciate it. All right. Let me go have an evening. Let me go. Let me go flex a little with this. With this here extra jacket. Okay. Um, definitely tune in tomorrow. I'll have that video up. It just may be a little bit later on in the evening. And you know, my calls play tomorrow. We got to win this. Okay. I need Philip Rivers to come through for me because I have zero faith in Michigan to come through for me today for football. Zero faith. Have you seen our team this year? Zero faith in the squad this year. It's like really embarrassing. So yeah. Yeah. Nobody asked me how Michigan does tonight. If we get a win, cool. I'm not expecting one. I'm just going to be real. I'm a realist. I'm not. I don't have a lot of high hopes, all right? But thank you guys again so much. As always, extra age, not your shoe size. Uh, I'll spill something on the jacket. No, the jacket's coming off before I start to eat. The jacket's coming off. Just know that. The jacket will be hung up somewhere. I don't have time for that. But all right, guys. I appreciate you. I got to get out of here. Peace.